so once again good morning to all of students so let me do that is the next problem what we have left yesterday we have discussed about the composition of the function and invertible function so in that we are discussing the problems regarding the invertible function and finding the inverse of f so here invertible function means we know already the definition of the invertible function when we say that the function is invertible so that is only if any function is said to be invertible if it is a bijective function if it is a bijective function that it means so it is one one and odd one if it is a bijective function then we say that it is a invertible function if it is a invertible then it has its inverse we yesterday we have discussed or through the composition also we can easily discuss that so but here we give the preference for using the bijective function only we will identify the given function in the invertible or not so to identify the invertible first we find out the whether it is an one one or not and on to or from let me discuss what is the given function we have here p is a functioning from r to r this is a given function and its definition is given that is f of x is equal to 4x plus p very important so it is a very very important topic that is a invertible for five months and these are the repeated questions whatever we are going to solve now they are repeated questions and they are very important for five months they are fixed for the five month questions so here so first we show that it is a one one and on to then we confirm that it is inverse if its inverse is express as x in terms of y that will give the inverse of the function so first we identify whether it is a invertible or not here p is e is one one here p is one one here p is one one means let me consider two different real numbers so we know real numbers let me come to that is one comma two belongs to the r so these are the two real numbers whether they are different or not different one is not equal to two then we find out the f of one f of one is equal to if you put where there is x one what we get four into one plus three four into one four four plus three so that is equal to seven f of two f of two four into two where there is x what we have to put we have to put two two plus three four two so eight eight plus three that is eleven so seven is not equal to eleven seven is not equal to eleven so therefore f of one is not equal to f of two so different element for the different image therefore f is is 1 1 if p is 1 if p is 1 one, next we prove that is the on so f p is on to f p is on to for on to we have to convert this x in terms of y so that is y is equal to 4x plus 3 Then we can write that is 4x is equal to y minus 3. X equal to y minus 3 divided by 4. We have converted that is x in terms of y. So next, so we know the how to state it for every for every y belongs to the codomain there exists. x what is x y minus 3 divided by 4 so it is now to be real number why because we have a fractions number in the real such that f of x equal to y f of x equal to y so it means that x is a three image of y and that x is there in the domain so then therefore Therefore, f is is called on to function. F is called on to function. F is both one one and on to. Hence, hence, f is 
the green is in the domain. So it is therefore therefore the F is on to is on. So what is the concept of this means? So for every element in the codomain, we have an at least one pre-image X which is belongs to the codomain. That is the domain. Then it is called as an onto function. F is called as an onto function. So here it implies that F is is both one one and onto one one and onto. Hence F is by the by the function the two function therefore f is invertible invertible and is inverse is yes inverse is equal to that is root y minus so this completes your example and it is very 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 important for a five mark question hmm. so next problem consider a from r plus r plus means positive real numbers to the Minus i u to where infinity given by f of x equal to so that is 9x square plus 6x minus 9 quadratic equation is there. show that f is invertible show that f is invertible so we have to show that it is an invertible find out the inverse find the inverse so in invertible on the those for me other inverse of convergence so let me take that is it's a definition how we take the find f of x equal to 9x square plus 6x minus 5 so first what we have to do to show the inverse was 1 1 and r so first f is 1 1 so for 1 1 let me consider two different elements 1 comma 2 belongs to the R class. So positive real number we have to take. So these are the positive. So you can take 0 and 1 also. You can take the 0 and 1 also. They are positive real number. Better to take that is 1 comma 2 only. 1 comma 2. So that and 1 is not equal to 2. So if you put f of 1 so 9 into 1 plus 6 into 1 minus 9 plus 5 15 15 minus 5 that is equal to 10 next f of 2 9 into 2 square plus 6 into 2 minus 12 4, 9, 4, 36, 36 plus 12, 48, 48 minus 5, 43, 6, 2, 4, 9, 4, 36, 9, 4, 36 plus 12, 48, 48 minus 43. So then f of 1 is not equal to f of 2. Therefore, f is 1 1. Why? Because different elements have a different definition. So, next we move to that is a onto function. For moving onto function, first we have to convert that is a x in terms of y. So, here we have a quadratic equation. The very important thing that we have to 9x square plus 6x minus 5 
So here the notion of effort square is very important here. Why? Because it is a quadratic equation. We are not able to easily simplify and convert x in terms of y. So if we convert it as a perfect square, then we can easily convert. Perfect square to convert to perfect square, we have to know about the identities like this. A minus B whole square and A plus B whole square. So A minus B whole square means A square minus 2AB plus B square. So A plus B whole square means A square plus 2AB plus B square. These two identities should be keep in our mind. And to make the perfect square like this, we have to reduce the quadratic equation in this form. Then we can easily write in like this. So for that, so how they are? So we can write that is 3x whole square plus so 2ab, 2ab we have to write 2, 2 times of 3x. So what about b? b is 1, 2 3 is a 6, 1. So b is 1, we got the b value. Let me write x square. It's a square we one square. We have added. If we add anything, what we have to do? We have to subtract. So here we got minus one as it is there. Now here we got a square, two a b plus b square. Means what we can a plus b whole square we can write. That is y is equal to three x plus one whole square minus minus one minus one minus. So now we can easily convert that. 3x minus 1, sorry, plus 1 whole square is equal to, if you bring minus 6 on this side, what happens? y plus 6. So then 3x plus 1 is equal to root of y minus 6. If you bring this plus 1 on that side, what happens? x is equal to root y minus 6 minus, sorry, sorry, plus. Plus, sorry. So if you bring minus five, minus six on this side, it will become a plus six. So then mm, plus one on that side divided by. So we have converted that is a x in terms of y. So using this. So now we write that. So for your p, f is f is. On -code. For showing the on code, we should must and should express x in terms of y. So f is on code. Uh, for for v, y belongs to the four domain. What is the four domain we have here? So that is minus pi to infinity. Pi to infinity. There exists x. What is x? We have root y plus 6 minus 1 divided by 6. So it is belongs to the r class. So we get positive real number. So if you take that is the any number more than this including this up to infinity they are belongs to the r class. Such that that is a free image f of x equal to y. That x is a free image for every y. So Therefore, f is is on to f is on f is is both both one 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 and on to. Therefore, f is bijective bijective function.
So next we come to that is another example and it is very important also prove that the function f from n to s defined by f of x equal to 4x square plus 12 x plus 15. Another quadratic problem where s is in a range of f. Where s is a range of f and is the inverse what we have to show is the inverse and we have to find out its inverse for finding the inverse we have to convert the x in terms of y and so now here we have to find out whether it is a invertible or not to show that it is a invertible we have to prove it is a 1 1 and on so first yeah is 1 is 1 so let me consider a natural number 1 comma 2 belongs to n and 1 is not equal to 2. So then we find out the images f of 1 is equal to 4 into 1 square 1 plus 12 into 1 plus 15. So totally we get 4 plus 12, 16, 16 plus 15, 20, 31. 15 plus 12 is a 70, 27, 27 plus 30, 31, f of 1. Next we find out f of 4. So that is 4 into 2 square, 2 square plus 12 into 2 plus 16. So 2 square 4, 16, 16 plus 15, 31, 13, 31 plus 20, 24, 24 plus 31, 55, 55, so 31 is never equal to the 55, then f of 1 is not equal to the f of 2, therefore f is, is 1, because we know that different elements have a different images. Therefore, we can say that if we have this one. Next, for on, for on to, to show that the function is on to, we have to show, first we have to find out, we have to express first that it takes in terms of y. So, y is equal to what we have, y is equal to 4x square plus 12x plus 15. We should remember those identities that what we have in a brief a plus b whole square. So here we write that that is 2x so whole square. It is a plus 2 times of 2a. 2a b means 2 to the 4. 4 into 3. 12. So 3 is a b. So we got the b. So plus b square b means b. 3 square plus 3 square minus 3 square minus 3 square 9 plus 15. So that as it is only. So here we got that is a square 2ab plus b square is equal to 2x plus 3 whole square. So minus 9 plus 15. So minus 9 plus 15 means plus 6. That is why. Bring this on this side. 2x plus 3 is equal to y minus 6. So, full square. So, 2x is equal to y root y minus 6 minus 3. 2x is equal to root of y minus 6 minus 3 divided by we have converted x in terms of using that we have to for a so on to we can easily say that the range of the function is yes it is equal to the code so again f is on to uh, range of range of f is equal to yes it is equal to code or therefore f is on f is on f is one one 
Thank you.